Hi, boys and girls. It's Mrs. Diamore. Today, I'm going to be reading Dog Breath to you, The Horrible Trouble with Halitosis by Dave Pilkey. There once was a dog named Hallie who lived with the Tosis family. Hallie Tosis was a very good dog, but she had a big problem. Halitosis had horrible breath. Whenever Halitosis opened her mouth, horrible things happened. <laughs> when the children took Halitosis for a walk, everyone else walked on the other side of the street. Even skunks avoided Halitosis. But the real trouble started one day when Grandma Tosa stopped by for a cup of tea and Hallie jumped up to say hello. Uh-oh. Mr. and Mrs. Tosa were not amused. Something has to be done about that smelly dog, they said. The next day, Mr. and Mrs. Tosis decided to find a new home for Hallie. The sign says, free dog to a good home. The children knew that the only way they could save their dog was to get rid of her bad breath. So they took Hallie Tosis to the top of a mountain that had a breathtaking view. They hoped that the breathtaking view would take Hallie's breath away. Get it? Breath taking, taking breath away, but it didn't. Next, the children took Halitosis to a very exciting movie, The Breath of a Salesman. They hoped that all the excitement would leave Hallie breathless, but it didn't. Finally, the children took Hallie Tosis to a carnival. They hoped that Hallie would lose her breath on the speedy roller coaster. They read the sign that says, you'll lose your breath on our roller coaster. <laughs> but that idea stunk too. The plans to change Hallie's bad breath had failed. Now only a miracle could save Halitosis. Sadly, the three friends said goodnight, unaware that a miracle was just on the horizon. Later that night, when everyone was sound asleep, two sneaky burglars crept into the Tosis house. The two burglars were tiptoeing through the dark, quiet rooms when suddenly they came upon Halitosis. Yikes, whispered one burglar. It's a big, mean, scary dog. Ah, don't be silly, whispered the other burglar. That's only a cute little fuzzy puppy. The two burglars giggled at the sight of such a friendly little dog. That dog couldn't hurt a fly, whispered one burglar. Come here, Poochie Poochie, whispered the other. So Hallie Tosis came over and gave the burglars a nice big kiss. Oh boy. The next morning, the Tosis family awoke to find two burglars passed out cold on their living room floor. It was a miracle. The Tosis family got a big reward for turning in the crooks, and soon Hallie Tosis was the most famous crime-fighting dog in the country. In the end, Mr. and Mrs. Tosis changed their minds about finding a new home for Hallie. They decided to keep their wonderful watchdog after all. Because life without Hallie Tosis just wouldn't make any sense. I hope you enjoyed that funny story. Dave Pilkey is one of my favorite authors. And enjoy Read Across America Week.